Congrats on your new Sony Bravia 4K Google TV. So let's set it up for the first time and let the entertainment begin. We will start by connecting your Sony TV to the power. You'll get a power adapter and the power cord included in the box. So attach the power cable to the adapter, then insert the power jack at the back of your TV. You'll also need to ensure that you have inserted the batteries in your Sony TV remote. Now we can go ahead and turn on our TV. We will land on the welcome screen and begin the setup process by choosing our language. So let's select English and now select your region or country. Then you'll get two options, either set it up as Google TV or set up as basic. If you choose basic, then you won't be able to use any streaming apps. So you should always go with Google TV. Now you can either set it up using the Google Home app or you can set it up right on your TV using your remote. So we'll just go with the remote to keep it simple. Then choose your Wi-Fi network from the list and connect to it. Now it's mandatory for you to sign in using your Google account. So go ahead and log in with any of your Google accounts. After logging in, you need to accept to the terms of service and also the Google service. You can choose to uncheck these options if you want. And when you're done, tap on accept. Then you'll get some prompts for Google Assistant, so choose your options accordingly. If you want to use it, then you need to agree to all of them. And lastly, choose your streaming services that you want to be installed right during the setup. After that, you'll need to go through a small setup from Sony to get more rich entertainment experience. So just tap on start, scroll down and agree to their privacy policy, hit next and activate your Sony voice remote. This will also enable Bluetooth, so you won't have to point your remote at your TV after this. To set it up, press and hold the volume down button, and while holding it, press and hold the Google's voice assistant button. Keep holding it until it says activating, and it should say activation complete within a second. So press OK, and now you can use your remote via Bluetooth. Then it will ask you to set up a broadcast type. If you don't use a cable service or set the box, then you can just skip this step. Press next on Apple AirPlay and HomeKit, tap on done, and now just sit back and let Google finish setting up your TV. Well done, your Sony Bravia Google TV is ready to roll. But to get the best viewing experience out of your TV, you may need to take a look at our video about best picture settings for your Sony Bravia TV. So go ahead and do that and make sure to subscribe for more.